Knock, knock. Who's there? Notch your muffle up. I swear, rust can kick rocks. This is as dumb as it gets. That Toyota. One six two zero nine nine three one right there. S A N G O Sango. Not really loose. Rather good and tight. The XLE or the SE factory twin tips and so forth. Only problem is right where the flanges are, it came apart and rusted. Turn on the flash and show you down in here. So either gonna try and fix it myself or just say hey mechanic fix it for me take a minute to really appreciate this clean underside she is really good for her age really not that bad at all even this little dampener thing with the sway bar or the tree line arm still moves up and down and uh, looking at if I can find it the plumbing for the fuel system still pretty good not really that rusty but anyways, the reason why I wanted to do this video is to give you a nice little startup of her without the muffler, just direct pipe for a 3VZ. So, let's take the muffler and set it here and set the phone up against it. And uh, without further ado, now you can hear it. Oh shit. Alright, that should have the muffler in the video. Now we'll start it up for you. If I had more free time and everything, I would do a drive-by out on some back roads, screaming, but there she is. I had cords out here ready. Went over to uh, Hazard Fright, bought me a brand new Bauer angle grinder, and even bought me a nice little cut-off electric instead of air, but uh, I was able to wiggle it off, and uh, I was gentle enough. I didn't cut the grommet, so... You still have the grommet there, and then you got the other two grommets right there. So, you know, hopefully get this bad boy fixed, quiet her up, and then get her cleaned up again, take pictures, and put her up for sale. But there's an update on the 93 SE leaky exhaust. But other than that, she's uh really doesn't need anything else right now. Thanks for watching.